What's good, YouTube? Today we're going to react to Jalen Thompson. He's the top defensive player in Michigan. It's we, got, we got to check him out, bro. If he's the top player in their state, I want to check. Like, I got to check. I feel like I got to check him out. You feel me? So, you know what it is. And he come in today. So, he got seven predictions to go to Michigan State. So, we're going to see where he ends up going. Off rip, easy inside position and just cause a pick. I ain't gonna lie, I like how the whole team turning up right there. I love energy, bro. I feel the energy, real talk. Come here, sit down. But he's 6'3", 245 pounds, so he probably gonna be pretty quick, is what I'm getting. From that size, I feel like he's gonna be a quick player. And he's top 200 in the whole nation. He's a top 30 defensive lineman overall. So he he ranked pretty well. I ain't gonna lie, who field is this? I kind of like this field. The red, that red, that red look tough. It's different. You know what I mean? You don't see like Boise State, the blue field. Like that shit different. Come here. Hey, he just grab you just in his face. He just gonna grab you and bring you with him. Like you ain't escaping him. <laughs> bro had the easy. Bro could have had an easy block, but couldn't do it. He tried to dive in at him. <laughs> bro went in here first. Why would you think that was gonna happen, bro? You playing one of the. You playing the best defensive player in your whole state. Like what what did you think was gonna happen? And I actually um I ain't what's the name of the top player in Michigan? I think it's Dante Moore, ain't it? Ain't Dante Moore the number one player in Michigan? I'ma actually check that at the end of this. I ain't gonna lie, whoever this team was, he was just dominating. Hey, he was just killing them the all game. I wanted that they win this game. They had to, right? They had to win that game. Here go this red team again with the red field. They but not be sorry. I ain't gonna lie, they red team kind of look trash. How do you got a nice looking field and you be trash? Like that just can't happen. Unless I'm wrong and maybe they be, maybe they good and maybe I'm just. Hating. <laughs> I'm not really hating. I'm just saying they got a nice ass feel. But yeah, Michigan State, they were pretty hot. Like, two. Well, I'm going to say at the beginning of last month, which was, it's August now. So, July, at the beginning of July, at the end of June, Michigan State was one of the hottest teams in college football with recruiting. They were getting players like every single day, man. So, to get the top player in Michigan, what top defense play in the Michigan, that would be a huge pickup for them because they already got an amazing class. Like, let, let me see what they rank right now. They fail. Oh, never mind. Wait, am I tripping? They fail. I ain't gonna lie. I think they might have lost a couple of players, too. They were definitely ranked higher than this, bro, because they were getting players like left and right. See, look, they they had got by Joe. They got um. I feel like I'm missing names though. Like I remember Demetrius Bell, Chance Rucker, but it, I feel like it's way more players I reacted to. I know Jordan Hall. I don't know, man. Maybe I'm over um, rating them, but I could have sworn that class was much better than that. I wonder how how many decommits have they gotten? They had to have how they had to have some of them because I swear that class was way higher, but. As y'all can see, seven predictions to get Jalen, so that'll be a huge pickup in state for them. I just want to see when the latest ones. Eight six, eight six. So the latest ones were like a couple weeks ago. I feel like not much really gonna change. It's seven predictions, even though a couple of them are from April, but still, like you might as well book him to go there for real. <laughs> but yeah, man, he looked pretty nice. He's gonna be a game changer. Especially with that class. Don't sleep on that class, though. The couple players I have watched, they are difference makers. So, hey, don't sleep. But that's going to be it for the video, and I'm going to catch y'all next time.